what's up everyone let's go ahead and listen to some mark langan or maybe it's langan or lanigan we're going to listen to his song one way street off of the album field songs which was released in 2001. So I've never heard of him, however, uh, this particular track was recommended to me by I Ate Granola. I literally just got that. <laughs> so, so thank you so much, I Ate Granola. Uh, like I said, I've never heard of Mark, but you said that I might be interested in him. Uh, and you gave me a couple of songs to look into, and this was one of them. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and listen to it. Um, so I'm looking at his Wikipedia page right now. And it says that he is uh, a member of Gutters, or I'm not sorry, not of Gutters, or I guess, yeah, that was one of the bands. He's known as a member of Queens of the Stone Age and the Gutter Twins. Like I said, I've, I've never heard of him, but we're going to hear about him today. So let's go ahead and pull up the song. We'll talk about it after. And uh, here we go. One Way Street. Interesting effects behind the guitar. Stars and a moon are where they're supposed to be. Well, the strange electric light it falls so close to me. Love will come to right. I'm not seasick. Rolling wave And you know that I am Just trying to get it out I really like his voice. Very much Tom Waits like. Dressed in white, send roses to me. I drink so much sour whiskey, I can't hardly see. And everywhere I've been, there's a well that house my name. From the one tiny sting to that vacant flame. Oh, the definite road. Remember that's called a one way street. And you can't get it, can't get it down without crying. I'm curious about the sound beneath this all. That's interesting.
Not quite sure what I was expecting, but that wasn't it. But I had a good time with it. This kind of occupies the same space as like a Tom Waits or a Nick Cave, at least from what I've heard of them. And because I like their sounds, I'm finding myself liking this as well. Uh, his voice definitely edges into that, that particular realm of that deeper, kind of occasionally guttural excuse me voice and i i really like that to me i find that kind of voice very satisfying i find the way he sings and delivers uh his singing in this very fun and enjoyable i should say more so to listen to i really like the atmosphere that's built beneath everything because the guitar the, the music itself it plays pretty straight but there's this really interesting ambience that's undercurrent and undercutting everything here which almost sounds like this this sort of radio signal or transmission of some sort. And I can't quite tell what's going on in that signal, but it, to me, it never comes across as just noise. It sounds like it's actually something, whether it's like music that's been, of course, very edited and, and produced in a certain way and, and just twisted and mangled, or maybe voices, or, or I don't know. But it's not just a staticky noise that's in the background. It actually has substance to it. I just don't know what. <laughs> It is. Now, the name of the album is Field Songs. Maybe there's a, a sort of um, field music uh, kind of kind of glamour to this. Maybe there's a field music side to this. Maybe every song on the album has these kind of you know transmissions in the back. I'm not sure. That I can't say. Uh, but I do think that the actual soundscape of the music is really interesting to listen to, uh, especially when taking that into consideration here. Let's look at these lyrics. The stars and the moon aren't what they're supposed to be, but this strange electric light, it falls so close to me. Love, I come to ride high on that seasick rolling wave, and you know that I'm just trying to get down. Oh, the glorious sound, oh, the one-way street, but you can't get, can't get it down without crying. Like, you can't experience this without sadness, without grief, without tears, and without crying, like he says. When I'm dressed in white, send roses to me. I drink so much sour whiskey I can hardly see. And everywhere I've been, there's a well that howls my name. From the one tiny sting to that vacant fame. Not Maybe he's saying he'll drink himself to death? Oh, the deafening roar. That's called a one-way street. Like there's only one way down and there's no way back out. Except going back the way you came from, I guess. There's an ending to this. Through the mysteries of sight, you can't get out. In the psychotropic light, you can't get out. Love, I come to ride high on that seasick rolling wave. That's the way that I fall trying to get out. So he's trying to correct a course in his life, that one-way street. And, that, and he says, that's the way that I fall. That's the way that he fails. Perhaps that's the way that he dies. Trying to get out and dig himself out of that hole. Perhaps pulling himself out of that well. Then he just repeats the chorus there. Nothing down there, but really, really interesting song. I like that. Even he even has kind of that's like a similar look to what I've seen, like of like a Tom Waits kind of look. Like that's good. I like that. Let me know what you guys thought of the track in the comments down below. You can follow me. Oh, let me bring you up. Follow me over on Twitter, support the channel on Patreon. Thank you all so much for being here. Have a great rest of your day, your evening, your morning, your afternoon, and I'll talk to you all later. Bye, guys.